I'm Ricky Johickey at EOA TV, bringing you your local arts update. Thursday at 3 p.m., the Frontier Art Center in Burns holds its pottery open studio for folks who have already been introduced to ceramics through previous pottery classes. Auditions for an Enchanted Bookshop Christmas with the Eastern Oregon Regional Theater in Baker City will take place Thursday and Friday beginning at 5 p.m. The Alpenfest in Joseph kicks off their weekend festivities on Thursday at 6 p.m. with live music performed by the Polka Tones. They will be playing at Terminal Gravity until 9 p.m. where a ceremonial keg tapping will take place. The rest of the festival with live music, dancing, and handcrafts will take place over the weekend at the Joseph Community Center. On Thursday at 6 p.m., you can also catch OPB's Organ Art Beat at the OK Theater in Enterprise, Oregon. This is a free event, but you must register in advance. Light food and beverages will be provided. Visit www.theoldok.com for tickets and more information. At 6 p.m., Eastern Oregon University's Theater Department will be holding auditions for Dracula. Cold readings will be supplied. For more information, contact Professor Mike Heather at mheather at eou.edu. At 7 p.m. in LeGrand, doors open at HQ for their weekly open stage. This is a prime opportunity for performers to see and hear what other artists in the area are working on. Open stage is for all ages until 9 p.m., so be sure to grab the performer in your life and take them to HQ to sign up for a 10-minute performance slot. Friday from 5.30 p.m. to 7.30 p.m. at Manemacini Studios in La Grande, you can participate in a haunted house acting workshop. Space is limited, so please register in advance at www.holisticacting.com. Saturday morning from 9.30 to 10.15 a.m., the Pendleton Center for the Arts will have a free drop-in class for youth up to age 12. Youth under eight years of age must be accompanied by an adult. Saturday from 10.30 to 11.30, join the Pendleton Center for the Arts' as creative staff members for a casual, no pressure, get together. They'll work on a different project each week. No need to sign up and no tuition, just drop in. Saturday at 9 a.m. at the Painted Sky Center for the Arts, participate in an Arttober Challenge. Join in as they teach Scraffito and Mishima clay techniques to design seven coasters from daily word prompts. Register in advance at www.paintedskycenterforthearts.wildapricot.org. Saturday in La Pine, celebrate their newly remodeled library at the grand opening. There will be face painting, live music, balloon animals, and a ribbon cutting at 12.15 p.m. Saturday at 6.30 p.m. will be auditions for the Night Fright Productions Haunted House. Auditions will be held at the Haunted Warehouse, located at 410 Railroad Avenue in Embler, Oregon. Sign up in advance at www.holisticacting.com. Monday at 4.30 p.m., the Pendleton Center for the Arts holds their open art studio for ages 5 through 12. And then at 6 p.m., they will have a Holiday Creations $10 drop-in class. Tuesday at 4.30 p.m. at the Grant County Fairgrounds, you can catch the Circus Monster Mash. It will be spooky fun for everyone with traditional circus acrobats, magic, jugglers, clowns, and more. Go see the spooky costumes and makeup with chilling music and thrilling performances. It will be a spectacularly fun time for all ages. And from 4 p.m. to 5 p.m., there will be a class for short film screenwriting at the Pendleton Center for the Arts. This class is designed for teens and runs for five sessions. Following the teen screenwriting, there will be an adult screenwriting class at 5 p.m. Also happening at the Pendleton Center for the Arts is the second of their multiple class series, Teen Clay. Please be sure to register in advance by visiting www.pendletonarts.com. Tuesday from 6 p.m. to 8 p.m., there will be a hand-built clay forms class with Brian Purnell. This is a nine-session series, and you won't want to miss out. Brian's depth of experience will help students transform material into a permanent, functional, and beautiful object of your choosing. You will learn the basics of proper wedging techniques, clay storage, pinch or coiled pots, slab construction methods, using molds, and brush and dip glazing. Register at www.pendletonarts.com. Wednesday from 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. at the Pendleton Center for the Arts, there will be a beginning wheel throwing pottery class. This is a seven session series. Adult Guitar for Beginners also starts on Wednesday at 6.30 p.m., so be sure to register online and save your place. Wednesday from 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. at Art Center East in La Grande, the six-week class Cowboy Poetry, the Tradition, and the Legend begins. Also happening on Wednesday at Art Center East is an art grief group. This group offers an alternative to traditional talk support groups. 
and as a place where you can experience support and express yourself by making art together with others. Register in advance at www.artcentereast.org. And if you have a passion for the arts, please consider joining a local Art Center board. For example, Art Center East in La Grande is seeking additional board members from a variety of backgrounds. To learn more and submit an interest form, please visit www.artcentereast.org. If you are an artist and enjoy teaching your craft, please contact your local art center about teaching opportunities. Most art centers have online artist interest forms. I'm Ricky Johickey, and this has been our Eastern Oregon Arts Update here on EOA TV.